Crypto's local bottom has been confirmed. Here is why. It is for many, many reasons. But reason number one, we have been at a massive, massive, massive bull flag for the better part of a year now. And the measured move takes us to 85K. Every time we are at support on this, it is scary and everyone is going to apply to McDonald's again. And every time we're at the top of the range, it's high fives all around and everyone's quitting their McDonald's job. Right now, we are at the bottom of the range yet again. Reason number two is the RSI is at 25. This is now extremely oversold. Reason number three, the fear and greed is an extreme fear. Not some fear, not a little fear, not a moderate amount of fear, but extreme fear. In fact, we have not felt this level of fear since the Luna collapse over two years ago aka also the literal selling climax of the cryptocurrency market when i say selling climax i mean the selling climax and wyckoff what you'll notice is the secondary test in phase b goes lower luna was the selling climax ftx going to zero was the secondary test in phase b when we look at ethereum we have not been lower since luna went to zero that was the selling climax reason number four when we're looking at the stock market one of the worst crashes we've had since black monday down over 10 percent when we look at the rsi though same thing 26 extremely oversold when we look at the the fear and greed on the S&P 500, it is at 19. Extreme fear. Not some fear, not a little fear, not a moderate amount of fear. Extreme amounts of fear. In fact, we haven't been this low since October of 23. This was the last major pullback that we had in the market. Let's address some silly willies commenting on this video saying it aged like milk. First of all, I posted this video on July 12th and this video was referring to another video which I posted a week prior. This video is over one month old. And what I said was this was guaranteed to be a local bottom. It in fact was a local bottom and from that time it went up 31% over three years in the stock market gains. This is a completely separate move one month later. And in fact, I said that we would go to 64 and back test. I didn't think we would go this deep, but now that I'm seeing it, it makes perfect sense. So what do I think is next and what am I going to be doing? I think that the next move is at a minimum. We're going to test the top of this at about 65 K again. The next macro move is finishing out the bull flag of about 85 K. It, however, would not be weird to backtest it one more time. That wouldn't be weird. I don't necessarily think that that's going to happen, but ultimately this is what's going to happen. When others are fearful, you should be greedy. And when others are greedy, you have been fearful. We have experienced maximum fear. And over the last couple of days, I've went on a major, major buying spree. Here's some of the things that I have bought. Link, Quant, Theta, ICP, Solnik, and many others. In fact, about two months ago, I said, if Link got to about $10, that would be a gift from God. Well, my friends, we have gotten a gift from God and I do not squander my gifts. Any chart that looks like this with a big old cup and handle, a U, a W, however you want to view it, this is the most bullish chart. Any chart that looks like this with fundamentals, real tokenomics, and good inflation, I am buying right now. As for you, though, you should always DCA. If you can't DCA, then the second best thing to do is nothing. And the third best thing to do is follow me for more, you savages.